So today it is, let's see, April 5th and I am heading out to the city because I have to get some things. I am having my breakfast also. I have planned to meet up with my sister in the city and um, yeah, I need some stuff for my nails. I want some nail hardener and I want some like cuticle oil to just, you know, my cuticles are horrible. My nails are doing pretty good. I'm happy with them so far. I um, got into like filing them, which has been really great. And I also need to buy a present for one of my nieces. So that's what I'm planning on doing today. Also, I want to get my steps in and that's about it. My sister also wants to get her steps in and maybe she also needs something. So that's about what I'm going to do. I am going to have my breakfast first, of course. And that's about it. Then I'm going to leave. So I'll talk to you later and I'll take you with me. So let's go to the city together. Mm. Gold, gold, gold. Oh, look at it, it's Yuki. Cute. I think they're chasing some mice. Like, look at them. Whee! Okay, so this one is pretty cute, I think. I would never have chosen this one, but my sister behind the camera gave me this one. It's pretty cute. But wait, there's more. Yeah, then. Shit. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, do you think ook echt leuk, man? We have this one, yeah, but this one, it's resting on my cheeks. Oh, yeah, with the puntje. Yeah. <laughs> That's inconvenient. But it is pretty cute. This one is also pretty yeah, cute. This is also leuk, but it's too light. Yeah, I, don't think it I will, like that one better. Yeah. It's just from my balcony. It's fine. Yeah. King's Day is coming up and so they are selling lots and lots of items for King's Day. Like, look at it, this hip bag. It's so cute. And of course, some schmink to put in your face with That's our shink. Dutch flag. Whoop whoop. <laughs> it's cute. Ah, oh, look at these sushi socks. I would definitely buy them, but I don't know. I don't do socks. My socks get ruined so fast. They just suck. <laughs> socks suck. Now they are cute though. Let us speak inside the box. This is going to be the present. It's like rocks with little lights in them. It's salt rocks. Salt rocks. This is such a cute store. Look at all the stuff they have. This is a store that I really, really like. However, I don't come here that often, but when I do, I want to see everything. Dobby. <laughs> yes, at her take up. I am going to buy these three letters and it's going to be a little bit of a preview for something that I am going to do, but you can maybe guess it. Look at it, this is typical Dutch clothing. Or well, we don't wear it anymore, but we used to in the old age. And of course, a little windmill. Look at it. So at this store, they do sell some American products. And I discovered something. I taste tested this drink and I discovered that the bottle caps are different. Like they say different things on them. Get the good things flowing and on island time. These are also super cute. I do want to invest in them like at one point, but not now. Um, so yeah, these are my sisters, but they're super cute. Whew. Hey Lemfem. So I am back in my car right now and I did buy some really nice stuff. I did however spend my like the allowance that I give myself for this week. So the rest of the week I have to be you know a little bit careful with my money but that's okay. I don't plan on leaving the house in terms of like going to stores the rest of the week. I also bought my present. I do have to go to the supermarket but that's like another I have this other jar of money that I use for you know grocery money. So I'm okay. I wanted to try taste test this little cute drink that I got. This is what it looks like. I've never tasted it before. Let's taste this stuff. I have no idea how to pronounce it. Maybe like hata or something. I have no idea. And also it comes with a little bit like some instructions about the cap. I have to 
I think I have to push this thing down. I don't want to break it. Okay, that's not the solution, I think. Why can't I just open it like so? Okay, maybe read it. Take off the cap. I did that. Then there was this thing on top. I think I do get it now, so I have to... Okay, there is this little like push thingy that was in here. I can get rid of that, I think. And then I have to push down into like the cap. Okay, let's let's hope this works. Oh my god, seriously. I think like this is made from glass too. How do I open it? I'm thirsty. Ugh. That's what she said. <laughs> oh How does this work? Oh my god, it tells me to, yeah, just to push it down. Okay, don't die. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, I've never... <laughs> Never ever have I tasted something like this. So the little ball, it's a little glass ball I think. It just like plopped in here with all kinds of bubbles. I have no idea like what it is for. It smells really good. It is strawberry flavored. They had like mango and strawberry and I was like, yeah, classic strawberry. I really like that. So the this is really funny. Like look at it. That's so cute. So yeah, let's just taste it. This is how many calories? Let's see how many milliliters are in here. It doesn't really say, I think. Hataramune. Well, I would say this is about 300 milliliters. So let's say it's 400 just to be safe. This drink is 200 calories, give or take. That's what I'm going to count for it. Bon appetit, let's go for it. Oh, the way that you drink is very annoying because the whole that you drink out of is super small, but it's really, really good. Um, I didn't know, but it has bubbles in it. Obviously, I could have known that because of like all the little air bubbles that are forming on the little bowl. But let me figure out how to drink this without, you know, I want to drink a little bit more quickly than this thing allows to. It is really good. I did find a way to drink it. You just make sure that your lips are covering it, but not entirely. So there is, you know, the airflow for it to empty out. And you just wait very long <laughs> for enough stuff to get in your mouth before swallowing it in like, you know, a normal sized um, zip. Sip. Yeah, it's really good. That was quite a little adventure. Uh, I'm going to enjoy this. So I'll talk to you once I'm home and I'll show you everything that I bought. Steady heart goes, I love you more You said it's your choice, but who's choosing? You told me we were the perfect song So I continue to sing along Now that I know what this is all about I'll stop talking and shout I am going to recycle my bottle It's made from glass Also this little veggie thing I just went to the store, this is what I bought. I bought two things with some cat food, wet cat food. I bought some of this artificial sugar, I ran out and oh my God, that's so annoying. Those things, like they last forever, but once you're out of them, really, really inconvenient. I bought this thing with celebrations. Tomorrow I'm going to see someone and this is what I will bring over to their place. I'm going to leave them in the car, like binge hazard right there. I bought five of those bags with cat litter. It's always nice to have some in my car, like on hand. I finally bought myself some soil so I can find Finally put my like basil in the ground and then finally this was on my list for a while I have like this yellow thing for my lemon plants or lemon tree I should say of course oh my god I'm dead do I have like sweat stains under there it wouldn't surprise me it is getting warmer and I only like I have or I am on 200 or no 2660 steps so I did not even walk like that much but still I am pretty dead but I also told my sister this like when you're walking just walking it's it's easier than when you're just like going through shops and stores and stuff because you're bending down and you're standing in place and then you walk a few steps you have to walk some stairs here and there so you know the, the way that you move in is different from just like walking but I'm going to show you everything that I bought so let's get into it here is my um, store haul Ugh, my hair keeps doing that let's see so first of all I bought like these uh, letters they're just made from cardboard they were pretty pricey for just some cardboard but also they're very sturdy so that's good that will be a project for another video that I will show you I have some tickets obviously a backup battery 
medicine. Then I bought some dry shampoo. I've never tried dry shampoo, so I have no idea. My sister said this is something that really works. I just thought it would not work, so I'm going to, you know, try it out for the first time. Since I am trying to take better care of my nails, that's why I wanted to go like in the first place for these two things like nail stuff and the present. I have some nail hardener and I have some nail oil. And there were a lot of other things that I was like, maybe I should buy that too. But I was like, let's just start with the basics. So I bought like a file or well, my sister did. And uh, so now I have a file, nail hardener and nail oil. And I was like, let's just take care of my nails for like maybe three weeks or four weeks, like a month before, you know, going next level with it. So really easy, just some hardener, some oil for my cuticles and a file to, you know, file them, not break any t-shirts with my nails any longer. Oh, oh my God. Um, so yeah, that's what I bought too. Since it's going to be King's Day, I bought a few items for King's Day. I have this schmink. It's just like some face paint with the colors of Reflect that you can just, well, it's red, white, blue, so it should be like this. You can just, you know, apply it and just for funsies. Then I also have two of these little clips that you can just, you know, clip in your hair. It's pretty cute. Then also I have this thing, like a little scrunchy orange with some Dutch flags on it that I can put in my hair. Like, eh. Let's just give myself a little makeover to try it out. I have to like look in the viewfinder. It's a little hard, but let's try doing it anyways. Mm. <laughs> Maybe just like more subtle in the back. Like so. Then I have these little clips. Eh. Oh, there's some tape on the back. Of course there is. They don't want you to steal those things, obviously, but it is super annoying. Scissors. Oh my god, I'm so happy that I bought these scissors so I can be lazy and just keep on sitting here instead of walking over to my kitchen to get myself some scissors. Oh my god. Oh, seriously, it's all sticky now. I hate stickers. I no way that I'm going to put it in my hair. Let's take off the sticker first. 2000 years later. Who comes up with these things? Oh my god, I'm really bad. <laughs> In this, this is just like in the middle of nowhere, but whatever. It's just to give you an idea. Then I also bought these super cute earrings also with the flag and orange. It's a little bit like it's our color. Let's put these cute earrings in. I know that once I lose some weight, I am so much more motivated to take better care of myself. Like with everything, with like nails, makeup, the way I do my hair, the way I like to buy new clothes. It's really stupid because you should take care like at every weight, but I don't know. Oh my god, my face is so fat that you don't even, like you barely see them when I'm just <laughs> wearing them. But yeah, I bought some cute earrings. I bought the little this thingy, which is just, you know, I just put it in like really quickly. And then the little um, hair thingy. So that's what I bought. It's really, really cute. Let's continue. I also have an appointment in like six minutes, so... Er I have to hurry like a little bit, eh. But this person, she's coming over, so I don't have to leave the house and everything is okay right now. So also let's take out, let's leave them in for a change. So let's see, I bought myself the present for my niece, which is like the photo doesn't do it like right. It's much more like prettier. I would like you to see it. I'm going to just very carefully take off the sticker. Uh, I hate stickers. Ugh. Oh my god. And the way that your fingers are still sticky afterwards. I hate it. I even have a big scar on my hand. I had one of those like fake tattoos one time. Like it, it felt like a sticker and I was like, oh my god, I want to, it, it has to go off. And I was rubbing and rubbing and rubbing until it came off, but then also like my skin came off and there's, yeah, uh, there's a scar because of that. Like, I don't know if you can see it. The one that's right here. Yeah, I think you can see it. So that's the story behind that one. I do have lots and lots of scars though. These are just too cute to not show you. So it's all these like salt stones. You know, I'm also going to give her some batteries. I do know that I have some batteries over here somewhere. <laughs> right here they are. Oh my God, they're so cute. Really good present, I think. Look at them. Let's turn off the light. That's really, really cute. It's so cozy and she loves like minerals and crystals and things like that. So I think she is going to be happy with these. Let's turn them off though. I'm going to place them back carefully. I'm really happy with this present. 
So I bought this thing. Then I bought some tapioca pearls because I've never had them and they sold them over here ready in five minutes it says. And I really want to try them. So I'm going to do some more research in how to like eat them, like how to drink them because I think that like they're going into a drink I think. But I'm going to see like do you drink them with coffee or tea or like just some other type of like liquid drink. This is what they look like. They had two kinds and I chose this one because the pearls are a little bigger and I was like yeah let's try it but let's try it like the right way. These are pretty big. I have no idea about like what flavor it is, but they look cute and they look fun. So that's something that we're going to try together, obviously. Oh, seriously, look at it. Okay, <laughs> that's everything. Or well, I took everything out of the bag. So here's everything that I bought. I bought some new lights for on my balcony. I do have some lights, but some of them are broken. So I bought some to replace them with. Two see-through ones and then two green ones. They're like solar powered, so no batteries, really easy. However, they do break eventually. I have this cable for my phone because Yuki ate my old one and I still have two, but I really like this kind for next to my bed. So I bought a new one and then I bought myself some craft stuff. I bought this sketchbook. It has black pages and so I was also looking for like a gel pen, a white one, but I could not find it. Also, I'm left-handed and when you're left-handed, working with gel pens is really hard because if you're left-handed, you are writing and gel pens, they stay a little like liquid after writing. And so when you write like this, you drag your own hand through the things that you've written. So it's a little tricky, but you just have to be more patient. Maybe that's where I learned to be patient. I have some washi tape, two different kinds. One with all different kinds of cats and stuff and one just really fun colors. And I bought this for this project because I want to decorate these and make them look fun and nice. And so I bought some different kinds of craft items and everything that I'm not going to use, like in case something is not going to be used, I am going to just return it. I have the ticket still. So, you know, and also I do have some sisters that also really like this stuff. I bought some of these cute ribbons. I bought some gemstone thingies. It has been a while since I bought like all these little tiny thingies. I used to love this stuff but every time that I am in like the store and I see this whole section I'm like oh my god and I see so many things that I get overwhelmed and I'm like I don't know where to start and this really gave me a reason and a start of like okay so I I do know kind of what I am going to need and what I would like and so that's really nice I bought some of these gemstones just some cute colors like they had so much stuff but you know I cannot buy everything some pens to use on the black paper I hope that they are going to work on the black paper because I could not find like a white gel pen I have some oven baked clay I also wanted to try to make something with that and it's like yellow and green so guess what I'm going to make I have different kinds of like letters and there's no ciphers in here, I think, but there is like exclamation point, a hashtag. There's like the at symbol, like the little A with the tail. I have some wool, some like golden wool with a spark. I have this thing to go in the background because like my Easter stuff, I have to take it out soon. And so this is going to be my new background thing. And that was my doorbell. And now lastly, I have two of these things with different kinds of paper. And that's it. <laughs> Oh my god, they smell super new. They smell like plastic. But now I have to go because my appointment is here. So these are the ones that I bought. And I'll see you later. Thank you so much for watching. Cutie. Come on, do you want to cuddle? Oh, yo, yo, yo. I almost forgot, but I also bought these sunglasses. I bought them specifically for me to use them on my balcony because I like to sit on my balcony every now and then. And I just cannot stand like the sun. I'm always like this. So um, yeah, that's why I bought them. I really like these glasses. They're super cute. And also Maka really wanted to have some cuddles. So that's really cute. He does not do that super often. Mwah. Cutie. He's even purring. Three days later.
so I did do like a little bit of like doodling and yeah it is seeable on like the black paper so I really like that and also like when you use it just on plain white paper you can also just see it really really clearly I do like the more fine point better because it's you know better for details and stuff like that but yeah it's pretty cool and it's pretty nice I am happy that they ended up working you're the night sky trying to make me see your stars the dark eternally now i see violet i can feel silent